Cleaning the oven is a job everyone hates, but I've come up with a really simple way to clean your oven using dry pack soda crystals. So when you've got a really messy oven like this, you can clean it away really simply in a few easy steps using dry pack soda crystals. So before you start, you just need to make sure that the power to your oven is off. Your switch may be out of sight in a cupboard. Mine's on the wall here, so I'm going to turn it off. You might want to put some gloves on when you're using any cleaning products just to protect your hands. And we're going to make up a solution of soda crystals and hot water in the sink. So you just fill the sink with hot water first and then you need to add about 250 grams of soda crystals, which is about a quarter of this pack. The first thing we'll do is to take the cast iron pan stands from the top of the hob and also the cast iron discs underneath. And then we're going to soak them in the sink for about two to three hours in the hot water and soda crystal solution that we made. And if they don't fully fit in the sink, then you may just need to rotate them halfway through the time. You've also got your aluminium rings on the hob as well. And we need to clean these, but we can't use soda crystal solution on these because it might dull the finish. So you just need to soak these in a solution of warm water and washing up liquid for a few hours and then give them a quick scrub. So we've finished cleaning the hob, now it's time to clean the oven itself. So we're going to finish removing all of the trays and shelves from the inside of the oven first. So before we start to clean the oven, we're just going to pop a towel down on the floor underneath just to catch any drips. If you find the inside of your oven is particularly greasy, you can sprinkle a few soda crystals onto the greasy spots and it will help to start dissolving the grease. You just leave it on for a few seconds and then wet your sponge, make sure the sponge has got quite a lot of solution on it and then just start to wipe away the grease. For some extra cleaning power, if you mix a little bit of washing up liquid into the soda crystal solution, it will help to lift the dirt and the grease, but make sure that you don't touch the heating element with this. Once you've wiped the oven out with the soda crystal solution and it's nice and wet, you just need to leave it for about an hour to soak and then come back to it. Give it another wipe out and then it should be nice and clean and ready for you to dry with some paper towels. After your pan stands have been soaking for a few hours in the solution, you can just take them out, give them a bit of a brush and you should find that any residue and grease has come off and then you can give them a final rinse under the tap or you can put them in the dishwasher for a final clean. Then just dry them off and then you can put them back on the hob. So the last thing to do before we finish is just to give all the shiny surfaces like stainless steel and glass a quick spray with some white vinegar and then just give it a wipe with some kitchen towel to give it a nice sparkle. So all that's left to do now is to turn the power back on and just run your oven on a low heat for a few minutes just to dry out the inside. And there we have it, the safe and easy way to clean your oven and hop.